Sam Hewen has still remained in the race for the coveted role of James Bond. He's facing lots of other prominent British actors like Idris Elba or James McAvoy in the race and fans are eager to know who will finally replace Daniel Craig. But so far, there's not been many updates. In this video, we'll take a look at the boring audition that Sam Hewen gave to play James Bond. First off, how the hell did the Outlander already give a James Bond audition and how did it go? Even though we're all waiting for the next James Bond to be announced, it seems some of the actors in the running to be him have already auditioned for the role. And for such an exciting role, you'd expect the audition to be equally exciting. Well, Sam just shattered those expectations in a recent interview. In his interview with Craig Melvin, he revealed that he actually auditioned for the role of James Bond back in his early acting career. He claimed that he had been eager to get the role ever since Eon Productions announced that they were considering a younger actor to take on the role. But fate had other plans. Apparently, they reversed that decision. The co-host Chanel Jones asked him what the entire process was like, to which Sam explained that it was actually really boring. He first remarked that it involved turning up in the middle of a fight and beating up a few bad guys, but of course, it wasn't as exciting as that. He later explained that it was actually a normal auditioning process, and he wasn't really excited to do it once he found out the details, but he gave the interview. Later on, however, the role went to Daniel Craig and the idea for a younger Bond was dropped. The hosts of the show insisted that he might still get away playing a younger Bond, but the Outlander lead wasn't so convinced. He claimed that he's probably too old for the role now, considering he's 42. Moving on to Hewen, proving that he's not just a gentleman on screen but off screen as well. We're used to seeing Sam Hewen play a gentleman on the popular historical drama Outlander. He's shown us time and time again by playing the role of Jamie Fraser how a lady ought to be treated. Well, his behavior doesn't stray that far from that when it comes to everyday life. While accepting a BAFTA award for his role in Outlander, he showed his fans that he truly embodied that role. Recently, the Scottish star won the audience award at the BAFTAs, and presenting him that award was none other than a place in the sun's host, Jean Jonathan. Well, as she presented the award to him, Sam gave her a small peck on the cheek, which made fans of the Scottish Highlander swoon. It seems Jean herself was a huge fan of Hewen when she posted a photo of herself from the awards night on Instagram. Along with the photos, she added a special mention of Sam Hewen in the caption. She claimed that the highlight of her night at the BAFTAs was getting to kiss the Outlander star and added that he was a proper gentleman about it. And that wasn't the end of her praises. She later posted a black and white backstage photo of the two and captioned it, saved the best for last. And well, we can't blame her for gushing about him online. The Scottish star was wearing a dashing navy suit with a turtleneck to accept his audience award for which he was very grateful for, following with a breathtaking excerpt from Sam's new book. While launching his new memoir titled Waypoints of My Scottish Journey, Hewen just released an excerpt from it to entice his fans to read further ahead. Even though his memoir includes details about his entire life, pre- and post-Outlander, it has many passages just devoted to his traveling lifestyle. To make sure his fans get a taste of the Scottish landscape, he's shared special moments of his hiking trips across the Scottish Highlands. And now he's even shared an excerpt from the memoir, which gives us a wonderful look at Sam's love for the outdoors and the beauty that Scotland has to offer. In the excerpt, he detailed a trip across the West Highland Way, which is a 96-mile walking route. He described it as a route for those people who wanted to fully experience the Scottish landscape. When he made the trek, he observed the mushrooms and the birds and the entire Scottish wilderness that crossed paths with him. Through the excerpt, it's obvious that he knows quite a lot about the topography of the Highlands. He mentioned noticing Strathfillan and passing by an old 8th century cemetery of sorts where old unmarked graves lie. The history and mythology attached to the place captivated Sam as he moved along. In the excerpt, the 42-year-old also remarked how he could be a nobody while climbing those mountains and that's how he preferred. Reading that excerpt would not just excite his fans to read the complete book, but anyone who wants to experience the wanderlust. Let's take a look at the 42-year-old star's book tour so far. To promote his new book, Sam's been busy with a long book tour across Britain. His book is a mixture of a memoir and travel writing and has been drawing a lot of buzz. So, his book tour is often swarmed by all his fans and with eager readers. The star of the historical drama recently held a book signing and meet-up event at the Waterstones on Sashihall Street. Many fans made their way into the city center and lined up to see him read a short excerpt from the the book and signed their copies. After the book signing, the Scottish star explained his reason for writing the book. He explained that the idea came with him while he was taking a scenic walk across the West Highland Way. He added that the long trek made him reflect about his journey through life and put everything into perspective. The Outlander lead actor explained that writing the book and mixing it with his journeys across the West Highland Way was very cathartic for him as it made him see how far he'd come. He mentioned that the journey towards stardom definitely wasn't easy and to 
despite his fans being so invested in his life, he still wanted a chance to tell his complete story. Hyun also added that he was very grateful for the achievements he's had in his career so far, but the journey behind them needed to be shared. With the book finally out, let's see what revelations we'll get from the Scottish star. Moving on to his Outlanders co-stars and their reaction to his recent win. The audience award at the BAFTAs isn't the only award Sam has recently received. The 42-year-old was also selected to be a part of the Esquire Men of the Year Awards in Madrid. At the award ceremony, he was given the International Icon Award, which he shared on his Instagram. The Scottish star shared several other photos from that night, one where he was even pictured shaking hands with the King of Clay, Rafael Nadal. And while his fans showered the photos with likes and comments, it was his Outlander co-stars whose reactions we loved to see. His Outlander love interest Katrina Balfe replied with many clapping emojis to applaud him on his win. His former co-star from Outlander Graham McTavish also chimed in and commented on his photos, but his comment was more on the cheeky side as he simply wrote, oh no, this short reply is just a reflection of the bond these two share. Working on Outlander together, these two actors have created a lasting friendship and have worked on several other projects together. They've written two books together titled The Clanlands Almanac, Seasonal Stories from Scotland, and Clanlands Whiskey Warfare. Apart from that, they've even appeared on a travel show together called Men in Kilts, a road trip with Sam and Graham. And yes, the show's been renewed for a second season, so we'll see the two promote Scottish culture together very soon once again. Graham was also seen promoting Sam's new book on his Instagram and with a cheeky comment like always, following up with more trouble as people continue to impersonate the Scottish star. With stardom comes other problematic stuff like invasion of privacy and people impersonating you. And by now, Sam Hewen is no stranger to such problems. He's posted multiple times on his social media, alerting his fans of others trying to impersonate him. And with the launch of his new book and him being in the running to be the next James Bond, he's had to make such posts again. He shared on all his social media accounts that everyone should be aware of online scammers who are pretending to be him and asking them for money. He wondered who would fall for that, but clearly there are some out there since he'd had to make such a post. The actor added that he will never reach out to anyone on platforms like Instagram, Twitter, WhatsApp, or Google Hangout. So the next time you see a Sam Hewen pop up in your inbox asking you to Venmo him a couple of bucks, please keep these words in mind. Wrapping up with the Outlander star cheering on Paolo Nutini. Apart from promoting his memoir, the 42-year-old has been enjoying other things as well. Recently, he posted a video of him singing along to Paolo Nutini's songs at his OVO Hydro gig. The Outlander star seemed to be a huge fan of the Iron Sky singer as he was standing in the front row and shared some special snippets from the night. Hewan shared moments of Paolo Nutini singing his hit single Iron Sky, which is a six-minute long song that even features a popular monologue of Charlie Chaplin himself. The Outlander star appeared to be starstruck at the event. This isn't the first time he's shown his appreciation for Paolo Nutini's music. Back in 2014, he tweeted about the song and tagged the singer as well claiming that it was simply wowzers. Well, there's no doubt that they must be pretty starstruck getting to see him perform on stage. That's a wrap for this video. What do you think of Sam Hewen's new book? Let us know in the comments below. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. See you in the next one.